the history of demand-side platforms has started in the late 2000s, along the uprise of programmatic itself. Since then, DSPs managed to completely change the way online advertising is done by making it more affordable, cost-effective, and data-driven. DSPs became a gateway to programmatic advertising. By the end of this year, advertisers are expected to spend a whopping $84 billion programmatically, compared to $70 billion in 2018. This amounts to 65% of all global online ad spending. Today, programmatic isn't new to the industry. However, there are still many questions that arise. How do you switch ad campaigns to programmatic? Where do you buy traffic programmatically? How to access top quality websites? How could highly automated media buying really drive better performance? And when trying to answer those questions, advertisers sooner or later come to demand side platforms. They start exploring DSPs. And guess what happens next? More questions, this time about DSPs, come up. So what exactly is a demand side platform? The demand side platform, or DSP, is an automated programmatic platform where media buyers set up, manage, optimize, and run online ad campaigns. The DSP is a technology that allows you to buy ad impressions in real time. Along with other marketing channels, like social media, DSP is an option to enlarge your presence on the internet. The DSP is built in a way to simplify media buying. It carries extensive capabilities like audience targeting, automated optimization, and real-time reports. In your everyday workflow, the DSP would look like a private account where you set up, start, and manage your ad campaigns, connect to traffic sources, and receive stats on your performance in real time. The backbone of every DSP is real-time bidding technology. This means that the media buyer sets a unique bid for every ad impression and competes for this impression during a real-time auction. For advertisers and media buyers, a DSP is a technology that keeps ad activities under control, but mainly, it's a vast source of online traffic. With its connection to hundreds of websites, supply-side platforms, or SSPs, and ad exchanges, the demand-side platform multiplies spots where an advertiser can reach and communicate with the audience online. On one side, DSPs have hundreds of media buyers. On the other side, DSPs are connected to ad exchanges, which, in turn, bridge them with SSPs, websites, and mobile apps. And the goal for the DSP is to make the purchase of a targeted impression. How does everything work? When the advertiser starts a new ad campaign, the DSP gets ready to receive ad requests for this ad campaign from ad exchanges or SSPs and bid on them. To bid on the right impression, the DSP stores an information array about the ad campaign. The DSP knows that this ad campaign needs impressions to match specific targeting, ad format, ad size, and so on. After going live, the ad campaign joins the real-time bidding auction. This means that it's ready to bid on requests coming from ad exchanges and SSPs. The latter send ad requests with a specific array of data about the user who will see the ad. That request also contains details on a specific on-site or in-app spot where the impression is going to be delivered to. Ready to buy this impression, DSP starts bidding. And finally, the advertiser with the relevant targeting and the highest bid wins the impression. Even though the process seems very complicated, it lasts no longer than a few milliseconds in real life. One of the most important metrics in DSP advertising is queries per second, or QPS. The number of QPS reflects how many times a DSP gets called to make a bid on an ad placement to reach a user. Higher QPS represent the speed and frequency of analyzing and acting on those requests. After making a bid to reach a unique user at a specific price, the DSP understands whether the price was accepted. If the price was not accepted, the DSP is made aware and it may require to use a higher price to win future bids. We've already found out that the DSP is a platform where users may promote their offers, services, products, goods, and so on, through setting up ad campaigns, managing performance, and driving new leads. In fact, anyone who needs to expand the promotion of products or services online may decide to advertise through a DSP. The DSP creates the perfect setting for running multiple performance ad campaigns simultaneously and its automation at all levels eliminates the human factor aspect. The platform needs milliseconds to deliver an impression and display the results of an ad performance on a private dashboard. 
ready to break into programmatic media buying? Sign up for dsp.epom.com and get a free tour around our white-label DSP solution.